Hi right, guys, welcome back. This is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to show you how to add together three fractions with different denominators. So the first thing you need to do then is look at your denominators of your three fractions. And we need to look for a number that 8, 6 and 12 go into. Uh, if you're a little bit unsure what this number is, then you can always jot down your multiples on the side of your page. So let me start with the 8. So we've got 8, 16... 24, 32, 40. Let's do about five of each one. Let's do our sixes next. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. And our multiples of 12 are 12, 24, 36, 48, and 60. So as you can see, 24 is the smallest multiple of each of the three numbers so if we put this on the denominator of our three new fractions okay so we just need to work out the top numbers now of our equivalent fractions so to do this how many times did 8 go into 24 well it went one two three times so we need to times this top number by three so 3 times 3 is 9. How many times did 6 go into 24? Well, that went 1, 2, 3, 4 times. So we need to times this top number by 4. So 1 times 4 is 4. And finally, how many times did 12 go into 24? That went 1, 2, 2 times. So we times this number by 2 to give us 10. So now we have common denominators, we can just add the numerators together. So 9 add 4 add 10 gives us 23. And you just keep denominator the same again. And that's our final answer. So if you like this video, like it and subscribe to my channel guys. See you next time.